Hello and welcome gamers to Halo Clans for today's video. Today's video is to update everyone on why the channel's been suspended recently and who was behind it. Alright, first off, a couple weeks back, a video was uploaded by one of my channel managers named Shaky Grusa, and this was a very inappropriate video aimed at Kurt. I get, yeah, Kurt has been a tad bit out of control within the community lately and has become quite an easy target and prey for uh, the bandwagon of trolls that run rampant within the community and just pile on anyone who's making any kind of impression within the media lately. But this kind of behavior will not be tolerated by YouTube and it damn sure won't be tolerated on my channel. As outlined by the rules that I send every person interested in becoming a manager, but on that note, this video contained nudity as well as other things that violated YouTube's terms of service. And because of the manner in which this video was presented, it broke several laws, in which case could be actionable in court by either Kurt or myself if we choose to do so. Violating both anti-bullying laws as well as civil suits, such as slander and defamation of character, which in small claims court is a maximum of $5,000 for each party against each person who took part in it. And that's just to show you how serious this is. After noticing the vid, you know, it only had 26 views at the time, so I deleted the vid as well as the managers from my channel, scared that the channel might be taken down from someone flagging this vid, or lo and behold, someone uploading another vid making me liable as the channel owner. During the short amount of time that the video was uploaded, the only person that had shared the video, and that was to one of the smaller Facebook groups, uh, during that time was Z4Bros. The fact that with my low sub count, and the fact that he shared the video 36 minutes before I seen it, and it had only gotten 26 views, would place him as one of the first people who actually seen the vid, therefore, he was probably involved with it, seeing how his channel name was mentioned in the video. So, with all this information kind of directing me towards Z4 Bros, I decided to confront him about it, and which he admitted to being part of this party that uploaded the video, therefore admitting to this act of conspiracy against my channel. When I pressed for more information and more answers, he blocked comms with me. At this point, I decided to drop it, and for the next couple weeks, all was pretty much normal. Last weekend, I uploaded a couple of videos over at a friend's house, and being sick, I didn't really look at my YouTube channel till about Wednesday. So, when I went to my channel to see how my vid was doing, I just wound up finding out that my account had been suspended, most likely due to the video that was uploaded that I had removed. And so, I appealed to YouTube multiple times and finally got my channel back despite planning for the worst, just in case I had several plans that would have had the chance. Uh, at least a new channel fully operational and with full subs despite having the current channel being suspended so it was no big loss however there is a fine line between shit talk trolling and being the despicable human beings that have done this to my channel i mean you can shit talk me on facebook xbox all day long you know we'll have a little back and forth you might even make me look like an idiot from time to time no big whoop but that is just totally crossing the line. No one deserves that kind of treatment, especially not having done anything to you whatsoever. Anyway, back to the topic at hand. I started to gather information from a couple of friends, further proving some guilt here. So here we see Z4 admitting that he was there once again mixed up in the conspiracy to take down my channel, along with uh, Irish Charlo, Carlo, I don't know how to say it, admitting that he knows who did it, despite no information really going public on this matter. Um, Shaky Joker has been rumored to be mixed up in this conspiracy. However, I have yet to receive any evidence on this, but I am keeping my mind open on the matter. Um, so, again, Shaky Joker, no evidence to quantify uh, him actually being a part of it. Then we move over to Power, claiming credit for not only taking down my channel, but taking down Dividable's video as well. Dividable can handle this however he wants. I'm just kind of alerting him to this, but I'm not going to give this much attention to him because I haven't heard from him in legitimately over a year since he refused to do an interview with me from way the hell back when. And he has not uploaded a video in over five months. And also, I went through and I asked a couple people, you know, has Power been active in the community at all? And everybody's kind of like, Power who? So, you know... 
he's just really a two bit has been trying to obtain his namesake and that is power. Um, and with a YouTube like his, this competition that he speaks of would be better suited to squeakers who doesn't know the difference between a shotgun and a sniper rifle. And the real issue that is in this whole process is one of the clan of the day videos was the vid that got reported and it got reported for spam. So I'm kind of like, the f*** does that even happen? I shared it like to two, maybe three groups and didn't look at it for three days. And it's not like the video was actually advertising anything except for maybe support for Clan of the Day 63 Titan Corporation. And this, if not resolved, will leave my channel with a bad standing. I think YouTube may have overreacted on this situation a little bit, suspending my channel with only one strike. Unless they looked at the other video, which I had already removed, but I don't see how that could happen because I'd already removed that video before this incident. And YouTube doesn't store videos once they've been removed once they're gone they're gone with that you know you guys set out to ruin someone's reputation but in the process you wound up hurting your own and i'm sure a lot of people in the community will agree with me on this one that by doing this to someone's channel and by attacking someone so viciously that you're just completely worse than the person that you set out to hurt that's right i said it you're worse than kurt and so yeah that's what about sums it up people um you know Dumbasses attacking my channel, or in some cases claiming that they attacked my channel. So uh, this has been Halo Clans, signing off.